Hi, my name is Brett. Um, I'm recording this message because I'm very concerned about what's uh, been going on in this country for a few years and what looks to be continuing to go on. I've considered myself a Republican almost all of my adult life, uh, definitely since college at any rate. Uh, Republicans believed in some of the things that I always believed in, largely based on my study of economics over the years. Uh, Republicans historically always believed in a balanced federal budget that we shouldn't spend more than we uh, bring in. They were always supporters of free market capitalism. Uh, Republicans were always in favor of free trade and vehemently opposed to tariffs and trade wars. Uh, they were against protectionism, whether you're trying to protect the country from foreign trade, uh, perceived enemies, or protect industries that are dead or dying. Um, most importantly, Republicans were always opposed to uh, bullies, and despots, and dictators. We embrace those things now, or at least Republicans embrace those things now, and I don't know what Republicans stand for anymore. Uh, the man that we have leading the country currently is a despot. I'm convinced he's a tyrant. Uh, he has no understanding of his role. He has no understanding of the Constitution or how it all fits together. Uh, these past four years have been a train wreck. Uh, they've been an embarrassment, and I can only imagine and shudder of what the next four years could bring. Therefore, I'm throwing all of my support behind Joe Biden for president. I've never been tremendously impressed by Joe, but I wasn't tremendously impressed by Gerald Ford either. But Gerald Ford was the person the nation needed at that time. He helped heal a torn apart country and heal our wounds and bring us together and unite us. I believe Joe Biden can step up and be for our country what Gerald Ford was in his time. Thank you.